particles P and Q simultaneously start moving from point A with velocities 15 meter per second and 20 meter per second respectively. The two particles move with accelerations equal in magnitude but opposite in direction. When P overtakes Q at B point, then its velocity is 30 meter per second. The velocity of Q at point B will be. In given question, P and Q, these two particles start from point A with velocities 15 meter per second and 20 meter per second. Point A, this is the direction of a particle P with the initial velocity 15 meter per second and second particle with initial velocity 20 meter per second. The two particles move with accelerations equal in magnitude. Acceleration of particle A is equals to B. But opposite in directions. So take negative sign here. Acceleration of A and acceleration of B. Magnitudes same but direction is different. When P overtakes Q at point B, then its velocity is 30 meter per second. The velocity of Q at point P. Let us take point B. At this point, velocity of particle P is 30 meter per second. And the velocity of Q. So we have to find out velocity of Q. Take equation of motion. V equals to U plus at. Substitute the values here. 30. Initial velocity is 15. Take acceleration with a positive sign. And time is t. Equation 1. Final velocity of q is equals to initial velocity 20 acceleration minus a. For the simplification, take equation 1 plus equation 2. 30 is equals to 15 plus 80. VQ is equals to 20 minus 80. Plus 80 minus 80 get cancelled. 30 plus VQ is equals to 20 plus 15, 35. Then final velocity of Q is equals to 35 minus 30 that is equals to 5 meter per second. Second option is correct. Velocity of a particle Q at a point B is 5 meter per second.